Stereotypes. I'm cool ass guy. You know I rock. And yeah, this is Stereotypes. This is where our director, Winston, he's gonna throw out some stories, real stories that's going on locally or maybe around the globe. And we're gonna try to figure out, being as racist as possible, who did it? Who the were fuck? Were they did white, it? black, Latin, Brazilian? Let's go! Yeah. Come on, Winston, with that, man. Alright, so in Mount Morris, New York, police apprehended three burglary suspects Sunday by following a trail of macaroni salad that they left behind while making their getaway. Thieves broke in and stole a cash register from Bilderberger Restaurant along with the establishment's entire surveillance system and a large bowl of macaroni salad. <laughs> what? All, all three the same rice? Yeah. White. White. It's gotta be white, man. You guys are actually right. They, they were white. Man, um, gotta be white boys! All right, so in Chicago, we have uh, two of the dumbest, but the most polite criminals. Uh, so these two guys, they went into the Clifton Grill in West Rogers Park demanding food and they uh, telling the owner, I will kill you and I will done with you. Concerned for the customer safety, the owner actually told the man that he was a little busy, but if they came back in an hour, he'd be able to, you know, Get robbed, officially. Right. According to the CBS Chicago, the man agreed to this, and when they came back, they demanded $100 in addition to- You came back for $100? When they came back and asked for the $100, the owner told them that, that he needed to get his wife's checkbook while he went to go get, quote unquote, his wife's checkbook. He called <laughs> the police. They stuck around and waited for that dumb shit? Yeah. Yeah, I'm here to rob you? All right. It's my, I had so, an appointment today. I'm gonna get your hundred dollars! Shit! <laughs> man, fuck it, man. I just gotta do this shit, man. I'm gonna rob this motherfucker. <laughs> Thank you for coming for your business. I really appreciate it. Uh, give me money, give me money, man. I need a hundred dollars. Give me money, give me money. Okay, you see I'm busy, okay? You cannot come and rob a store while I'm busy. Just give me one second. Here you go. Okay. Come on, I need the money now. Just come back now. later. Come uh, back later. Uh, later. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, sorry, sorry. Thank you. You're talking about that, man. Where is that hundred dollars? Where is that hundred dollars? I don't have a hundred dollars. I don't have it. I need a hundred dollars. Do you take PayPal? I need cash. No, I don't have any cash. I, I got my... Nah. No, I have to get... Uh, yeah, uh, give me something. Oh, I uh, Western Union. Hold on, let me, yeah, let me yeah, call. Give me something. Let me call Western Union. I get the phone number. Hello, Western Union? Yeah, there is a clown here at my store trying to rob me. He wants a hundred dollars. I need a hundred dollars. Okay. Okay, bye. The money is on its way. Alright, cool. You just stay right here. Money on its way. Alright, cool. A hundred dollars, right? Yeah, you been, yeah enjoy, you been enjoying this weather? Yeah, it's really nice. You know, the rain went away. So, you know, it's good when the sunshine yeah, come out. Yeah, my boy can come in again. <laughs> 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 what, 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 I really don't know. Yeah. I don't even know, man. You yeah. punk ass robber trying to get you got put on I, hold. I, I, I'm on the fence with this one, man. I really don't know. Chicago, all right. It's in Chicago. We say Hispanics ah. or some type of like Asians. I'm gonna say mixed. young white dudes, man. Young white dudes. Young, young white dudes trying to thug it out, man. Mario Garcia and Domingo Garcia Hernandez. Get your pesos, player. Hundred pesos. You put you gentlemen. A woman in Springfield, Missouri, uh, was pretty pissed <laughs> off 
Uh, so, so kind of local. Hits home. Kind of a local spin here. Uh, so she was pretty pissed off because she was ripped off by her drug dealer um, who sold her sugar instead of crack. Ooh. So guess what she decides to do? What did she what? decide to do? Call the police. So she called the police. So she called and was like, hey, my drug dealer sold me some bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> Go get his ass. <laughs> That's black, man. That's black, man. That's black all the way, man. That's some petty shit, man. That's a black chick that did this shit, man. I'm gonna say I know white, it is. I'm going to say a white girl. I'm going to say a white girl who was already on call. That was a black chick, man. That was Tasha. Tasha. <laughs> I, know, I know that was Tasha. Black. White. White lady. Hey, oh, man. Hey, man. Springfield, Missouri, Missouri not Nashville. Illinois. All right. So, uh, next one we got in Dallas at a Wells Fargo Bank. A 49-year-old man was going in there to rob him. Uh, went up to the teller, uh, demanded money. Uh, instead of uh, giving him money, the teller asked the man for two forms of ID. Okay. He, he gave it to him. Even worse, the, the teller had even stalled and even made copies of the man's ID. Like, you want to open up an account? <laughs> here, fuck that. Here, here, like, fuck that girl. Here, man. Here. Yeah, before Let's you open get, up an account, we ain't got no interest. Before you get arrested, I'm gonna get five more points if you just sign these papers here. I got some slick shit, man. Yeah, so he was black. He was black. It's white guy. White guy. What's his oh, name? Man. What's his name? Nathan Wayne. Nathan Nathaniel. Wayne. Nathaniel. That's hella white too. 